Uxbridge have won seven games in a row and are unbeaten in nine. The green line struggling at the bottom. All the stats look daunting, but Guernsey are good at defying the odds when it really matters. Can they do so tonight? Duport has got plenty of time to turn and set off over the halfway line. Plays it out to the left-hand side. For Govine, I think that is. Tries to go on the overlap again for Duport. He's done well. Duport now has the ball near the corner flag for Guernsey. Checks into on his right foot. He's trying to work space for the cross and eventually he does fling it across. And I think, was it an own goal? I'm not sure. I think Finn Duport will claim that one. I don't think it was a shot. I think it was probably a cross, but it's taken a deflection off the head of a defender. And it's Guernsey won. Uxbridge nil. Hainsworth clips a high one into the left channel for Govine to chase. He should keep this one in as well. And there's options in the area if Govine wants to use them. Plays it back to Duport, who can line up another cross. Clips the ball into the area. Once again, it's been oh, cleared only as far as Sam Murray, but it's been blocked. Just inside the Uxbridge half. Arrowed into the penalty area by Charlton Govine. It's over the heads of everyone. He might drop here for Ross Allen. And he strokes it home from close range. And Guernsey are 2-0 up just after the half hour. And that is 298 goals for him. So he's a brace shy of the Magic 300. Taylor gives it to Fern, who plays it into midfield, where it's been intercepted again on the edge of the halfway line. Loose ball falls for Loring. First time pass around the corner to Hainsworth, who now gives it to Simon Arnold in the right-hand side of the penalty. You can go to get a third. Arnold, I think he was going for the shot, was maybe a little bit greedy. Free kick sent down the line, the edge of the area where... Finn Duport's battling for it. Oh, it's been cleared off the line. Guernsey nearly making it three there. It's headed back towards goal by Murray, but that one's going to drift wide. Recently, they managed it well tonight and they'll need to manage the second half well if they're going to hold on to, to get three points. They haven't had a clean sheet yet this season, so that's one of their, their aims. Charlton Govine might pick the ball up here and that's a beautiful effort and it's just helped over the top by George Legg. Vodin, who's overdone it a little bit. It's a little bit careless from him and Uxbridge are going to try and break down the left-hand side now with... Okora Hay he goes into the penalty area. Guernsey got to be careful not to bring him down and he's been halted for the time being, but he's still going to get a chance and he strokes the ball into the bottom corner and there's no clean sheet for Guernsey tonight. You can even see from here, Tony Vance is furious on the Guernsey bench. Once again, Guernsey have gifted their opponents a way back into the game here. It's 2-1. A goal to half the deficit and now they're pushing for the equaliser and has it dropped in? It has. I'm not sure who got the final touch. It's been scrambled home. Guernsey defender kicks the post in frustration and once again... That gift that they gave them earlier has given Uxbridge a lifeline. Not sure they'll put it in exactly the same place as to where the equaliser came from. It is a higher one towards the far post. It's headed down. Someone trying to scramble over the line. They nearly do so again. Josh Addison with a brilliant save on the goal line. Just pushes the ball away. It was just wait begging for someone to tap that one in. Helped on and it's gone into the back of the net, but the offside flag is up and it's not going to count. Careful. Taylor plays the ball out to the left-hand side for Feyisitan. High cross from him. Headed down by Whittam, well held by Addison. He had to dive to his left to hold on to it, though. Needs to release the ball quickly, though. Out to the left-hand side. It's a good pass for Woolbridge. Overlap is from w Wallace. It's a really good overlap. Wallace is into the penalty area on the corner. Drives it across goal. It's taking a touch. Oh, it's just evaded Alex Ward at the far post. George Legg, the goalkeeper, stuck out a hand to divert it away.